Who ruled the land? Man, I look like shit. No smoking. I'm gonna keep smoking. Even though I don't condone it, I don't like these people, so they can uh, deal with it. Um, let's see. Let's let's go ahead and take a look at the specials. They got kielbasa. They got a uh, Denver cut, a Tucson cut. Huh? Empty. Either he's got a whole lot of customers, or he doesn't have any. I'd go with the second. Right. He has no customers. Uh, the frozen meats. What's what's that? Ew, they look like shit. Not very appetizing. Frozen solid. Who'd want to eat this? Sirloin steak. You get four four for sixteen dollars. Whatever it is. Oh, I get to ring the bell. Bigby Wolf. He doesn't look very, uh, happy to see me. What happened to you? I'm looking for a piece of the magic mirror. Um, wh what? The magic mirror's missing shard. Where is it? Bloody Mary brought it here, didn't she? What? B Bloody Mary? Magic mirror shard? <laughs> what kind of place do you think this is? Don't bullshit me. I'm not. What you're looking for, I I think you'd be better off looking at uh, the Lucky Pond. Yeah, or someplace like that. You know where it is, right? It's around the corner and a few blocks down. I've been there. I didn't find what I was looking for. Had some words with Jersey, too. Words? Anyway, if, if I'd have known you already looked at the Lucky Pond, I, I, I wouldn't have pointed you there. I, I just figured anything worth a damn in Fable Town goes through Jersey's hands at some point. You know that. Believe me, I don't want to waste your time, Sheriff. And I certainly don't mean to offend. I don't know how else to help. <laughs> Where's the magic mirror shard? Quit fucking around and tell me. I'm, I'm not. I am not fucking around. If you're lying to me, I'm gonna find out. Listen, Crane had the mirror. Mary had Crane. She comes around here, right? If you're covering for her, I'm gonna have a problem with you. So you better think real hard about what you say next. I... Sheriff, I... Oh, man, he's hiding something. Did you hear that? What? Oh, I'm real sorry. Hold on. I, I just gotta go check on that. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Butcher? I just have to go see. What's that button you hit? What's that button you hit? I gotta open this. Shit. Oh, shit. I remember seeing this area from the trailer. I got it covered back here, Sheriff. I'll be right out. Is that cow? Are those cows? I don't... Just wait out front. I I'll be right there. I I've got a bit of a mess back here. Relax, Johan. I just want to talk. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Yeah, safety purposes. Come on, damn it. Such an innocent guy, you're acting pretty damn strange, Johan. I don't know what to tell you. Oh shit, what's gonna happen? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. They're gonna kill me. Oh god, she is gonna fucking kill me. He's gonna get me killed. Oh, tap him. Things I do. Huh? How you doing? Please, please, Bigby, please don't. Bigby? What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. I don't want to die. Please, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Listen, just calm the fuck down, okay? 
I just want some answers. Okay. I'm dead. Either way, they said to me, Johan, you could keep your life and lose your shop or lose both. What would you do? It was a simple choice to make in the moment. Easy even when they got down a hook in the deep freeze. They? Do you mean Mary? Bloody Mary? This isn't my shop anymore. That crew took it from me a long time ago. Crew? Fuck. Oh, boy. The crooked man's people. Jersey Devil, D and Dumb, and that mental case, Bloody Mary. Y you want to talk about the real butcher? <laughs> it's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me. Took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. All cause of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. Oh, I'd let Mary and those porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. I'm just a victim in this. I don't know what they do back there. I swear. A and I don't want to know. I'm not allowed to know. Well, we're about to see what's back there. And then we'll see if I believe you. I knew this would happen. Didn't know when. But there would be the day. Big B Wolf would walk through. All right, so we just got to open it up. We'll see if Johan is telling the truth here. Oh. Holy shit. What's going on back here? This is like a meth lab back here. Run. Run. Oh, so he hit the buzzer and it caused them to run. Hmm. Swine snout, nosebleed. What the fuck? What is this place? I told you, Big P. I don't know. They muscled me out. I swear, I don't know anything more. I haven't been back here when it was like this. Mm-hmm. Warning lights. This business. It's all I've ever had. I guess that's why I stuck around when they took it. These lights, Johan. Did you warn them I was here? I had to. You come in here making trouble for me. But you only give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes or something. Where were you when they took this place from me? It hasn't been easy for me. You, you think I want to live with this at my back? I needed help. I needed your help. Well, I'm here now. I'm gonna sort this all out. That's good. That's good. We can do this. Oh, glamours. This is where they're making the glamours. So this is what Beast was delivering. Glamours. Other kinds of magic. Could be dangerous stuff. Holy shit, what do we look at first? Um, let's look at the packages over here. That symbol. It's on all the packages. What is it? That's the Crooked Man's, uh, brand. It's on everything that goes in and out of here. So you do know something, huh? Is that a, a wheel or what? I guess they never used that thing on wolves, huh? What's that supposed to mean? It's from back in the homelands. A torture device. He came over here with the rest of our stories. Not that Mondays need any help coming up with that kind of thing. It makes people crooked. By breaking their bones and... Oh. Do I really need to explain this? No, you don't have to. I get the... I get the message. Alright, so... Um, what is... Let's look at the chemistry lab. What are they making here? I'm just a butcher. You want to talk T-bones? <laughs> that I can do. This stuff is out of my league. There are a lot of nasty spells you can make with the right equipment. And look at the shackles. Chains? Who's getting chained up here? You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his yoke. Well, I know that, but who was it? I just need to know. Is this what those loans get you? That crooked piece of shit. Ribbons. Chains. It's... It's all the fucking same. Mysterious jars. Let's go ahead and examine these. Maybe just don't touch anything back here. These are raw materials for making magic. Anti-Greenleaf and 
any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. So all we gotta do is just shut down this place and we'll be fine. Too bad they had time to erase it all. This could have been useful. Oh, oh, yeah, there's another board behind it. Ah. Shit, thought I had something there. What the hell is that? It's a jacket. Whose jacket is it? I know this isn't your coat. What's it doing here? It's a coat. What's the big deal about some dirty... Looks like Cranes. It's seen some abuse. I'm sure he handled it just fine. Oh, we can, we're checking out his pockets. No time for traveler's checks, huh? Take the money. Oh, I can't take the money. I gotta leave that money. I gotta be the good, gotta be the good guy. And let's check the other pocket. I don't want to embezzle. That sick piece of... Last pocket. What's in it? The shard. It's the shard. Finally. Yes! Hey, hold on. Well, I'm real happy you found what you're looking for, Bigby. But what about me? Huh? What the hell am I supposed to do now? I'm gonna have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder for Bloody Mary. They won't care that I held up my end. Report to the business office. Tell Snow I sent you there, and we'll, uh... We'll figure something out. Some kind of protection. Thank you. Thank you, Sheriff. You're welcome. I mean, why wouldn't I try to help out these people? They all genuinely seem to think that I don't care about them, so I gotta change their opinion. <laughs>